That brings us to general public comment. Ms. Lawson. Hello. Yes. Go ahead. This is in regard to the, um, the smart meters and the LADWP. Our power was, ex was um, cut off on February 11th, 2013. And we have not had power in seven weeks. Sorry, excuse me. No, take your time. <clears throat> we, my mom and me and the rest of my family have been struggling now for seven weeks because we have not had any power. And this is a big, huge concern for us and we also come to find out that my family and 5,000 other people are also having the same problem with the smart meters. <clears throat> Excuse me. The problem all started because LADWP installed a radio frequency meter on our, on our house with small children, four small children, my sisters and brother, brothers. <clears throat> and because they installed that radio frequency meter on our property, my sisters had fevers of over, <clears throat> excuse me, over 102 Fahrenheit, and they kept on going up. This is not normal. This should not be tolerated. Excuse me. <clears throat> So once they installed this frequency meter on our property, we did not know exactly what it was. My mom had been, she did call and ask, what is this on our property? And they said, oh, it's a mistake, it's a mistake. Okay, um, I want some, high, one second. I want a high level person from DWP to connect with this family, find out exactly what's going on, and it, let's fix it immediately. Go, Mr. LaBange, Mr. Parks? I'd just like to know where she lives, the area. She lives, uh, I believe this is... Uh, it's 19 South Holt Avenue, Holt. We're down the street from Robertson, so Hamilton High School area, that's where we live. So Mr. LaBange, one more. Mr. LaBange, did you... I just want to get the address. I think that's uh, near Hamilton High School. West no, we've Sanders. got it. All right, good. Thank you. 2619. Yes, I'm sorry to interrupt you. So my name is Ms. Lawson. I'm an LAUSD employee. I took off today. I am responsible for my school, Johnny Cochran Middle School's ESL students. Unfortunately, when I complained about the smart meter put on a property, I was told there was no smart meter on a property. It's a radio frequency meter. When I began to express to LWP the health concerns that came out of nowhere, they told me that I was making it up. It didn't make any sense. My husband and I had numerous people come to our house and explain to us that it must be something else in your home. So I began writing to the general manager, Mr. Nichols. He ignored my emails. So for months and months and months, I had begged DWP to please take this off of our property. We were told everyone else has it. I found out that no one else had it except for us. We were the, we're the only ones in our Beverlywood area who has a smart meter on our property. I have four small children. I have a total of eight of six children in total, from 20 years old to 15 year old, to five, to four, to one, to nine months in my arms here. And we have had no power for seven weeks and one day. Easter for our children was horrible. We're cooking in the camp and oven. <laughs> We sleep every single night together. We have no eat. The children have been sick. We live by candles and we can't afford anything anymore. All our money goes away. We lose the formula. We lose everything because we have nothing, no power. We've called and spoke to Mr. Solomon. They just laugh at us pretty much. <laughs> we can't afford much for our kids anymore. We used to have a better life. 
So we don't understand why the power company would do this to a family with small kids. And we don't understand. We have to tell our kids daily we have no power. It's time for us to go to bed when the lights go down. They have nothing. Okay, thank you. We'll get to the bottom of that today. I want is is I want somebody on the phone right now. Is anybody on here looks from like, DWP? Looks like Tom's on the phone right now with DWP. I, I think we, you know, we shouldn't adjourn this meeting until we get DWP here. I mean, thanks, Tom. You know, okay, that ends uh, general public comment. Have we received word back from the Department of Water and Power? Mr. LaBonge is on that now. Okay, what other business is before this council?